375 grund right now are you kidding me all right let's look at that let's look at that you know what i mean like that's this card is is such a huge card even i think at every level this card's a big card which is yeah, why that's... this card is gonna really be valuable because whether you're bronze silver gold diamond or or champion this should be yeah. in your deck and there's not that many cards where you can kind of say that so this is pretty special in that way and you can see here this is the guy i was talking about kush constantly opening packs and just dumping cards on the market mm -hmm. jumping ahead of everybody and you see he's jumping ahead and he like has 20 some... cents to kind of like put off you... people from jumping ahead of him so it yeah. puts a little space there yeah, I mean, there's a few people trying to dump him, but nobody's moving like he is. He just keeps going to the front of the pack. He's like, oh, really? You're going to go 420? I'm going to go fucking 405. Oh, you're going to go four? I'm going 380. Like, yeah. he's just constantly throwing himself, like, way out there just to be like, don't even waste your time. I'll just keep going further down. Like, you know, he's yeah. just really, like, taking that psychological, like, poker, you know strategy of like i'm all in I'll, I'll just keep bringing it down so you might as well let me sell my stuff first Jeez. you know it's it's pretty ruthless and he's been doing very well with it you know i think he has slowed people down because people are like oh what am i should just let him sell yeah. those and then i'll yeah. just i'll just make more after he sells those just, the, just the wait problem is the problem is he keeps getting more of the cards and he keeps yeah. staying in front so it's like a and then someone does jump ahead of him like this and you know he's too busy opening packs but when he comes back to down the earth on the grund he's he'll jump ahead of them too so yeah um you know one thing here i mean the these rare or these epics they come with a hundred airdrop points and yeah you can pick them up for 77 cents that's less than a penny per airdrop point and a penny per airdrop point is phenomenal yeah right am i right i mean that's i mean it's, so it's, I it's, it's 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 uh you know right now let's see you know right now it's it's about eleven thousand or so um points per sps per day you know and as sps has gone down like that that the the value of the airdrops have gone down right um but we don't expect SPS to stay down. And if you're just, you know, stacking SPS, you know, then you, it's not like you're selling the SPS at 11 cents, you know, mm -hmm. if you're holding it and, and, and just acquiring it, you know, with the plans to sell it at a dollar or 50 cents, then it's, uh, you know, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a great opportunity. But aside from even the SPS, like it's just a great opportunity to pick up these cards super inexpensive.